gratitude, great spirit, understanding that all of these waters are one water, the only water that we have on this planet. There is no new water that will come down unless it comes in on a meteorite. And so the need to protect our sacred waters, gratitude for all of the water protectors. Gratitude, great spirit, for this honor to sit in front of these sacred waters, which contain waters from all different parts of this planet, an ice shelf off of Antarctica, Mount Fuji, the Ganges, the Sahara, sacred sites in England and Scotland and Bali and Africa and South America, Standing Rock, and to offer a prayer, a gratitude, a blessing for these sacred waters, the gift of life upon this planet. Gratitude for these sacred waters that has existed on this planet in so many different forms. Its ability to show up in the form of vertical rain from the sky with the dance of the sun and the moon and the wind and the clouds to fall upon this earth and to fertilize the seeds that are our food and our nourishment our vegetables and fruits and grains and nuts and seeds and our trees, our medicines. Gratitude, Great Spirit, for this sacred water that also appears in the form of horizontal water. Fog and mist. Gratitude for the sacred water, the fresh water upon this planet in our wells and springs and rivers and streams and lakes and the salt water that is in our oceans, creating the tides, and all of the wildlife that lives inside of it. Gratitude, great spirit, for these sacred waters that are in our bodies, 60 to 70% a reflection of the water upon this earth, and the sacred waters that fall from our eyes are the mirrors of our souls to help fertilize this earth. Gratitude for all the wisdom and the teachings that this water holds for us in its clarity and transparency to teach us to be clear and transparent in our words or in our thoughts and our actions, to understand that its strength is not only brute force, but in the softness and its ability to wear down the jagged edges of rocks and boulders that are in a river to round pebble stones, down to even the sand upon the beach. The sacred water that shows up in the form of snow and ice upon our mountaintops and with the sun in the summer melts and brings the water back down to the people. Gratitude to the mountains that hold them up there and our glaciers. And in this moment in the form of hail during this prayer, gratitude for the sacred water that also shows up in the vertical form from the earth and steam. And the sacred water is heated by the fire at the center of this earth going through the layers of minerals and rocks and metals to come to the top to touch air for the very first time and be healing for our bodies. Gratitude, great spirit for the sacred water in our bodies, in every single cell, every organ. This water, sacred water in the seed and the egg of our mother and our father the gift of life, the continuation of life in the planet, in the wombs of our mothers. Gratitude, great spirit, for the sacred water, to understand the need to pray and celebrate and to protect these waters. To understand that it is not a resource to be bought and sold, it is the source of life upon this planet. And so gratitude to all of the water defenders and the earth protectors and the forest guardians and all of the indigenous peoples who still know how to live in harmony and balance upon this planet. Gratitude to all the people who stand up and defend that which has no voice, that is given no voice in our society, in humanity these days. The understanding that we are all in this together. We are all interconnected in this web of life, in this incredible symbiosis upon this planet. And so with this prayer, gratitude, great spirit for this sacred water, that is the gift of life on this planet. The understanding of the need to protect these waters 
to clean up the mess that we have made, the pollution and the poison, poisoning of these waters. Gratitude for these sacred waters and all of the people, because when we all stand up together, we are stronger together. And we become a wave that washes over this planet, creating a new humanity, a better humanity upon this planet. Gratitude for these sacred waters that retain the memory that hold a vibration. And so with this praying for peace for our planet, for love and healing and kindness and respect, as this hail falls from the sky into this sacred water, may it be a drop in a pond, like a drop in a pond that ripples outward. May this prayer of the healing of humanity during these times be the strongest prayer to help transform and transmute all that is not in alignment to understand that we are all one upon this planet. We are all interconnected like a web of life upon this planet. And anything we do to this planet, as an indigenous elder said many years ago, whatever we do to this web of life, we do to ourselves. And so the deepest of healing for every single human being, when you take a sip of water, may it be all the healing for every cell in your body to understand our truth of love and kindness and compassion to all beings, all species, all elements. Gratitude, great spirit, for the greatest gift that this water is in this life upon this planet. For all my relations.